But that was um, that was eventful. But we're back after a slightly enforced absence. Hopefully, everyone is going to join us again for the race. Sorry for the inconvenience, but yeah, we're back and ready to race. Now, let's hope the lobby's better this time. It should be, yeah, because we've got everyone in that's supposed to be here, so... Apart from Death Rider, that's... And apart from... He's meant Shadow to be Claw. here, but that's an alternate account for someone, and for some reason Shadow Claw went to spectate. And I don't know why. So, now he's not going to be able to race. One less Mercedes on the so that, That's fun. And again, it's good to see... Oh, Hoggy Bear's an absolute idiot. Yeah, he's new, he doesn't realise. You I can, told him today, don't you can, do anything until you see the you diamond. You can tell him to your blue in the face and they still forget. People it's like your kids, up. isn't it? You tell your kids not to do something and they just look at you and go, I'm doing it anyway. Oh well. He won't be at Germany. And neither will I. For very different reasons. No, I would for very different reasons. Oh look, people actually went on the right tyres. That's fine. That's good. I do have game sound, that's good. Spiral needs to field away on the mediums. Why haven't I got... Why am I part of... <sighs> I'm literally following... I'm in the car myself with the people. That's it terrifying. It won't take me out of TV pod mode. That's... Yeah, we had this the other day. Um, just panic. That's right. I'm, yeah. if, oh, there you go. It's come out now. Well, thank God for that. <laughs> uh, anyway. As, the, as they're all weaving down the straight. What is what at the Boy P2. David in P3. Tufty Candy P4. Messi 5th. Soft Ties for Tanky in 6th. Back to Medians for Tribal. Back to Sauce for Kyle. We Firmage. And uh, Huggy Bear. Can't believe you've done that. I've told you two hours ago, don't ready up before the lobby host. Unbelievable. Anyway, Overcome Orphan has gone for softs. Fair enough, that's an aggressive strategy. Death Rider, aka Kane Robo in P12. Sarah P13. Wadders at the back is going for softs, so he should streak into the top 10 very quickly on those tyres. And we'll see how he far should. he really can come. At the start, that'd be very. There's a lot more grip than these medium yep. run as well. But as the race goes on, if he can't get past them, he's gonna. He's messed up his own strategy there. So he needs to make sure he can get past them, get past them quick to make the most yeah, out of his tyres. Oh, it's a bit bunched It's definitely in the a very brave call. Sarah nearly collided with the Williams there. Uh, so yeah, we almost got time to bring back the question, but now it's a bit too late. Who do you think's, do you think's gonna win it? Is that the question? I don't know if anyone really wins with a game this terrible. <laughs> but I, I, I seriously think anyone in the top five has potential to win this. You never know, someone, you know. Mm. Like Kane's coming from P12, so he's got some pace, and obviously he's on the alternative strategy from some of the others as well. And he's obviously going to have fresh tyres, so he can take them longer and be a bit more aggressive. So he can also come through the field, obviously barring any incidences and stuff. It's as a goal. Sarah gets a drive-through penalty. That's not what she wants. She just let go of it a little bit too oh, well. quick. That's a shame, but we're we'll go off. Go the British Grand Prix. Oh, we're spinning at the uh, back as There's well. a car that's, going that's the two Renaults. nowhere fast. Kyle's there. Kyle. Sarah's just taking it very easy. Uh, I feel like I saw a flash of blue in the background, but that doesn't seem to be Tanky. the case now. Oh, Tanky's lost wing and he's lagging everywhere. I think he's playing ping ball. Wadders from last is up to ninth. Yep. The soft definitely work for him. Now we're to eighth as we've missed another oh, overtaking as he ran off out oh, on the field somewhere. Don't know that? what happened to Oven is oh dear, someone's uh, no. 
Jedi David is now at the back of the field. Yeah, Jedi, I think Jedi and a Mercedes spun. Uh, a bit of okay. a middle collision. I was just on the back end of it. As Waters has right wing damage. So, been a bit of an incident in the midfield. Horrendous. Midfield going on there. Thank you, no slightly, wing. but. Near enough. Yeah, there's going to be a party in the pit lane. Kyle's got less wing damage. Doing well for now, but unfortunately Kyle's got less wing damage. Uh, drive through to serve. I'm sad. But she's not going to lose as much time as these guys that need to go in and do the pits. So. No, because she's going. In, actually, she's going to jump all these guys that are doing a stop. So that's actually worked out really well for her. If we can just be patient. He's like going to change tyres as well, so that's going to put them right on the back foot. Mm -hmm. Body in the pit lane, like I said. Spyro Body in the front eight stayed out clean. Walked away from. Let's just enjoy this drive through the pit lane, shall we? Uh, what is the feck that she stopped? It's supposed to be a drive through. Oh, Unless she's done no. the thing where you can't. Pit stop glitch. Please don't say that's come back. Oh, no, there she goes. Oh, has it? No, she's just come out. No, she no. morphed out of the pit oh, lane. Oh, fuff. <sighs> oh, my, my heart was in my mouth there. I was honestly going to throw a controller. No idea what Sarah will be throwing. I, I'm just, oh, we're not being a party with I'm Sarah lost after the race if, going on. if that had happened. Huh. And that's a wall for overcome often. I think he's got away with it a little bit. Damage reset the track. Mm -hmm. Fine, no, there's no one behind him. Yeah. Don't think he's got much. Don't think he's got any damage. He's just gonna have a bit of wear on his tyres. Yeah, I think he just had a little, little bit laps. of a tap, but yeah. Anyway, let's get them cooled down. There's no battles going on at the moment. No. Kane's up to six though. He is. He's Close doing awesome. Boys. Starting to reel in Spyro. That was 2.2 .2 a lap ago. It's now 1.7, so we're starting to reel him in. Oh, and the uh, Kane's lost it. But I think oh, no. he's lost it. Because he's one of the drivers that have not been able to load a setup because of the uh, the new guy readying up even though he was told literally like five minutes ago not to do that and also he's on a different account um, isn't he so he might not have had a setup for that's a good point track. yeah but still he would have known what set up that he was running yeah you know, and he would have been transferring it over so he, yeah his first boy is now going yeah. another two temps let's have a look at Fudge boy he seems to be on the charge so let's go is he gonna Oh, he's just steady through Maggots and Beckett's. Loses a little bit of time through there, but it looks like he's got a better straight line speed than Spyro, so... Has he lost a lot of time through there? That's nearly half a second, so... Which gives Tufty's closer to him. Going to get into his DRS range soon. After that Feels first couple of laps, right everyone now. is just spread out everywhere, aren't they? They are spread out a little bit. I think the race will come to everyone. But as I was saying, I do feel really bad for Shadowclaw about now. But unfortunately, we can't do anything about it now. Mm -hmm. um, it's just, we couldn't. Oh. No, you Hopefully, can't reset a lobby from one driver, unfortunately. No, unfortunately not, no. It just not takes really too long. Disconnect. It's just a... Yeah, sorry. We might have considered it had we not already had one, but certainly can't do two for that. But um, hopefully you have a good week of practice, and uh, most of us will see you next week in Germany, where you'll um, undoubtedly drive well to get yourself a podium, just to say, hey, no hard feelings about last week. Stuffed is uh, in P3, I've just noticed. Yep. Yeah. 
So you got Duffy's at one place, Messi's at one place, you got We Family's at four, Tribes at one, you got Death Rider, obviously known as Kane's at five, Overcomes at three, and So's at four. Huggy Bear stayed the same, Tanky is down five, Jedi is down nine places, obviously with that incident. Wallace yeah, is at one place. Wing, I think. And uh, Kyle is down six, so. What is standing on those softs is that to go onto the hard tyres? Hopefully they might last the whole lap for the whole race, but they're not a they very will good be able race tyre. Yeah, it's not a um, very race tyre. Some people, tire, some people prefer them around here than others. They're not the best, but like I said, you can go to the end. So if people ahead of you have what happened to you, then they're not out of it yet. Mm -hmm. I don't think Kane's going to be pushing for a podium today. I think he's just trying to maximise points given what's going on. But let's just hope that that's the end of the drama. Again, really so sorry, Shadowclaw. Feel bad. Well, as, a, as an alpha driver myself, I'm hoping him and Jedi can bring some good points today. Obviously, you and McLaren driver, I bet you're loving North Spyro being in first place at the moment. Um, yes, but I'm not going to talk about that because we all know I'm a jinx. <laughs> so I'm just going to look at P2 instead. Actually, no, I won't do that. He's my former teammate. Shit. Um, <laughs> Quick, give it to the Haas. They always have bad luck. Ah, how did you know I'd gone to the Haas? <laughs> See, great mind sticking like there, Mackie C. everyone is basically keeping gaps for everyone. Yeah, I think they're just tyre management. Now, they're trying to think, is the undercut worth it? Is the overcut worth it? I'll tell you now, the undercut is powerful. But, at the same time, tyre performance is better for mm -hmm. later on in the race. So, it's a tricky strategic call. Which way would you prefer to be ahead now or at the end? Obviously at the end, I think, but yeah, if I you can manage them, your tyres. I see them pitting around about lap 16 odd. Yeah. Those anywhere after 14 easy, anyway. Yeah, those sort Anywhere after 14, especially yeah, though, yeah. After about 10 laps, they start to die off, so you want to try and get as much as you can out of those medium tyres. They are quite durable. They'll still give you some pace. Oh, Tufty oh, Candy's tough. not done that quite well. He's round. No See, damage, though. I told you I was a jinx. He skipped out of the wall. Messi. Well held. Messi through the B tree. We firm just we firm is not close enough, but he's going to be charging like a train now. As Tufty gets back on track. I'm going to see how damaged those medium tyres are now for Tufty because he'd have definitely overheated those. It's going to take him a lap or so yeah. just to keep cooling them down again. So what has this made a move on Jedi? He has, down for P12. I expect to see Wadders approaching the podium or the lower half in the latter stages of the race. Um, Jedi's keeping on the back of him, though. I know technically he's on hard, but yeah. Sarah is within a second of Huggy Bear. Obviously, I think Huggy Bear took her. She's got a DRS. Yeah. She's got to close that back up. We'll have a look as this is the closest battle on the track right now. Actually, it's not. There's one for P4. It's we firmage Ooh. on the back of Tufty Candy as well, but we'll go back and see what the Renault can do for now. She's just got to keep it pointing the right way. Don't try and do too much through the corners. Take extra care. So what is he flying on those hards? Fast slap on those hards. That's very impressive. We firmage we can't seem to make any real inroads at the moment. Uh, we're we'll looking at so through so some of baguettes. There's a second tree. Around here. Especially through there, that is going to hinder you. 
See how wide oh. he had to go just to get out of the dirty air there? Mm -hmm. Or did he go yeah. wide because he was in it? He probably went wide because he was in it. It's very hard to... to keep the line you want to keep when you're not dirty air. It's... Yeah. It's yeah, he pulls a little bit wider just to get out of the turbulence again. Just approaching the final corner. Will he give him the traction he needs out of the final corner though? Not really. Tufty's just floored mm. it and gone. Yeah, he's lost about three times in the last corners. Now it's nearly half a second, so he's not having the best traction coming out of the corners. It seems like with the slipstream and DRS, he's keeping just in touch, but it's just not enough to get past him. Indeed, but uh, very early days. Lap eight. Twenty six. You don't want to be following too closely as well for too long because your engine does overheat and with the new yeah, things it definitely. does give you less performance when your engine starts to overheat. It's a bit like last week, if your engine gets hot you are going to be losing a lot of time on the straights for the power outage as Tufty goes a little bit wide there. But uh, Firmage is not quite close enough to do anything about it and there's a uh, yellow somewhere, please don't be, okay you're fine. Oh. Tank has got through to P10. Not sure what happened there. No, now, what is it going to be into P11? Yeah. Don't think any damage done, but this will not be pleasant given that it, it's probably a 6 6 setup. It's not a million miles away from the setup I run around here, but it will not be pleasant. It's just too much front end. Mm hmm. Dead eyes down, uh, approaching Sarah now, and oh, we've firmly just got past Softy. Missed that one. Yeah, it's got past him and yeah, pulled the second away. On him, so saw a yellow flag, went to find out what it was, and then all of a sudden, I guess that's the alarm for we firmly to make a move. Softy is now trying to claw it back. He's gone back into DRS zone. You know how good he can be on traction out of a corner. So yeah, we've seen it already. A good run on him. Uh, there, it seems to be the car in front always gets the better exit, and the car behind always has the better entries. So it's a very, very strange very game they're playing strange. at this early stage. Very much a Ooh, third of the way through the race now. That'd be a warning. Tough yeah, proper cuts the corner. Look how much closer he is, though. He 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 doesn't know which way to defend. Ooh, Eventually, he picked one. I think we firmish backed out of there a little bit to give him room to make sure that they didn't collide. Yeah, to be fair, it's the best thing to do. This is about going on for oh, P12. Oh my Sarah lord, what the hell is going on there? Oh my they're god! Inside each other. That's Jedi's connection. That is fucking hell. Sorry, yeah, the game does that. Jesus the Christ! The game does that when the connection isn't great. It goes to the I player. I can't deal with this. Oh, that's it went ghosted. On the back end of Sarah. I'm not going to look at that anymore. Oh, I feel I feel ill. Can we sort that out? <laughs> I think the only way you can sort that out is if you ask Jedi to leave. No, I can't do that. I'm streaming. <laughs> we'll keep an eye on him if it happens pleasant. again. Jedi just overtook Sarah going through Magsa Peckett. It's going through her. That's not. I mean, I don't like to see that. But Sarah's coming like back at him though with DRS. Go on, She's Sarah. Not... You got this. You amazing human being, you. Go get him. She goes Let the inside. Oh my god, they're mounting each other. Oh, I think. Um... I'm scared. I'm sorry. It's, uh, that's just. Yeah. Oh, Sarah's lost it. She's no! Her... And she's lost the wheel. I think Jedi's connection is okay when he's on his own. It's when he comes up to another player, it it doesn't like it. He doesn't. So it's tough to try. Are going at it. Try. 
Tufty has lost some time. He's he's gone from P3 all the way down to P6. His tyres are not in the best of condition. He needs to start thinking. Oh, he's got wind damage as well. So where's he got that from? Did he have wind damage when he was fighting Tribal? I have picked it up, but he's coming in the pits. He's gonna have to go onto the hard tyres. Kane's gonna, he's in the second of Tribal. DRS is gaining. He's gaining. It's not quite enough. He's just going to stick behind him now, wait for the next DRS. And he should have enough speed if he can get a good exit out of Magnus and Beckett's. He's going to watch the dirt. Yeah, here. Make sure he doesn't. Oh, as Tribal oh, has lost it. That's. And it's a very unusual place to lose it on your own. Death Rider nearly took him out, took himself out while hitting him. Luckily he missed it, that was very, very close. There's Wadders and Overcome coming together. Wadders has overtaken Overcome. I think that might have been a bit of team orders yeah. there. That's a very easy move. Yeah, I mean, Overcome oh. will have done that himself anyway. He knows his tyres are pretty much done. As you see, struggling to hold it through Magus and Beckett's. <laughs> um, he's a smart one, he's an uh, orphan. He's always aware he's of what's going on around him. He needs to pit and get on those medium tyres. He's going to lose too much time. And gonna... he will. I'm pretty sure he's coming in. Yeah, he's coming there in. There you go, see? He wouldn't have not come in ha had he not yielded to his teammate. Oh, Kyle, that's uh, that's the first one of the session, isn't it? Uh, I think it is, but it's Waters sets another fastest lap. <laughs> Definitely Waters country around here. Like he's uh, smashing it right now. Imagine if he was able to still make a lot of work to do. Would have had a. Potentially had a pot, uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, is he, going for the is he going for last the first challenge? <laughs> well, maybe he has more fun doing that. We don't know, but maybe you can ask him if he makes the podium. We'll find out. Well, that's a long way away for now. We're 50% race distance, which, for those of you who are aware, that means there's 50% of the race still to do. <laughs> Because there's not much action going on track. There seems to be there's a lot of gaps everywhere. A lot of people four seconds behind. As Overcome gets yeah, the three second one. penalty. As one comes in, they all come in. Yeah. Just open up the floodgates. Who's going to be the You next never one? want to be first, but as soon as one, a lot of people yeah. are like, you know what? Screw it. I'm not first anymore. Let's go. Now, I'm sure it's entirely incidental because none of them will know about it unless they're all in the party together, which they're not. So it's all very mm. much. I think just based yeah, on we, we Firmish has a left wing damage, has a left end plate damage. So he must have had contact with Tufty, and he's carried. He's trying to carry on. Oh, fair enough. What the hell is this camera angle? There we go. That's better. I'm just. I'm still sad. Our song goes, don't worry, be happy. I will not be happy. Mm -hmm. It's going to take He's a while to get over the fact that we've had to restart the lobby, and then even then, people can't fucking wait and listen to instructions. Which means half the grid doesn't have an effing setup. It's ridiculous, it should never happen. Sorry, this has been a ranty stream, but my god. People just need to listen. 
We're getting close to people going on to their pit stops, so we'll see if the front runners yep. are going to start. Yeah, Orphans been in already, just now. So we'll be going to the end, and anyone that pits any time now will be also going to the end. It is a one-stop regardless of what tyre you start on. This Orphan has a really? mishap, because he's 24 seconds behind the person behind. Uh, pit stop. Yes, I know, but Kyle was 10 seconds behind him before, more than 10 seconds behind him. Hmm, I haven't stop. noticed anything, but what is his quickest again? He's, he's going for it, he wants to get that gap down, doesn't he? This fish boy with a penalty. Oh, it's fresh boy. He's going very slow. Messi's now gone into second. Oh, yeah. He's had an accident at Maggots and Beckett. Not lost any damage, but... I think we I all think have, he's... to be fair. <laughs> at some point. <laughs> yes, that's true. I think his eyes are done now. Is he going to go in the pits? No, he's going to carry on. Spiral win, though. Oh, he doesn't want that undercut, so he's going to trigger it first. He's going on to hard tyres. Has he, is he run out of stuff? Interesting, but... The spermage is in. Yep. I feel like he's going to get busy in the next lap or so. Jedi gets a penalty. Yep, yeah, and Firmage is going on to soft tyres, he's getting a wing change, so it's going to make him a little bit slower in the pit stop. This Huggy Bear has gone through, past him, and Wadders. This Wadders up, from, up to 7th, he's catching Huggy all the time. Let's go and have a look at him then. Firmage is in. Spiral out in P3. That's a good stop for him actually to come out there. Yeah, Knowing the other two the, are going to be following him. Surely. He's on the hardest tyres though, so everyone else, you know, if they pit and go onto the softs, he's at a disadvantage. But then at the end of the race, he will have the better tyre wear when everyone else is down to really struggle. So. Exactly, yeah. It's definitely all about. Yeah, there's someone's lost here through Maggots of Beckett, surely. Yellow in sector 2 and 3, I don't know who it is exactly, there's no... Nothing on my screen to tell me, but... I didn't notice the only any one that massive drop-offs. Mm. Didn't notice any uh, big drop-off in time, so I'm not sure what happened, up. but... Yep. Push boy is within a second of Messi. Stays out. He wants that second place back. Here we go again, another yellow. Uh, there's another Renault fan on the field. What is going on? The Renault fan is hungry for TV time. I'm not seeing, again, I'm not seeing any of the obvious signs of droppage from time, so I'm not sure what's going on, but I think it might just be I'm not be getting no slight, yellow flags, I'm just, I'm not on my It's like half spin somewhere, possibly. Tufty's in the pits again, so it might have been Tufty that mm. caused it. Might have been him that's looking, okay. He had a good big into this race, but unfortunately he's just fallen away. Mm. Since about lap four or five. He had to spin and never really recovered from there. And he's had damage as well before. Yeah, and I think he's just. Is, and there you go, fudging. He's lost even more time now. He's at 40 odd seconds, so. Maybe. I wouldn't say he had contact with Tochi because he's nowhere near him, but. No, but. Maybe that's the cause of. Be, yeah. Yeah, softs for Tufty to the end. I'm gonna go for the fastest lap, but don't really see the point. You're not gonna get one down in P12. Yeah, but no. you never know what's going to happen. Especially with all the... Oh my lord! <laughs> yeah, 
yellow, sector it's one. Kane's in. I don't know what that's all about. Tribal's in. Orphan's not having a good time. He's stopped pretty much on track. I think he's just been off. He's having a miserable time. Looks like he's not well, running. Well, he's gone fastest again. Yeah. 15 lap old mediums and he's gone fastest again. He's nearly plowed into the back of Tanky there, who's doing a solid job today in P6. Quiet race, but I think he's about to yeah. go up P7 as we firm. He just has a lot more straight line speed, better tyre beneath him, and just way more grip into the corners. Jedi David's into the pits down in P11 now. Um, Kyle's got damage, right wing damage. Oh dear. Help him, but he's on those hards. So I think he's just going to try and Messi go finally in from the lead. That's a massive job he's done there. He's going to come out in the top three, surely. On board with yeah. Fudge Boy. As uh, he might come out just behind Fudge Boy. Pits. Oh, that was as well. a Renault. That was a Red Bull. Overcomes off. Messi's coming out of the pits. pits now. Pit exit. Overcome lost it going before the pits. I don't know how he's done that. Yeah, just behind Fudge Boy, I think he will be. Yeah. Yeah, Overcome's a donor, yeah. It's a shame to lose drivers from the race, but it's also a shame to lose Orphan, who just can't seem to buy any luck this well, week. Waters is getting into the well, second season, I should say. Of Huggy. Yeah. For Huggy in his first race. Week. He's up to fourth. Yeah. First race, but um, won't do two in a row after that. Um, nope. <laughs> patience on the grid. It's tough to get a three second penalty. But can't, he's the back of the field, so. can't even be lenient with him because he was warned twice today, plus one more before the lot race, so it's unfortunate. Oh, oh. <laughs> this car gets a penalty speed in the pit lane. A trick lane, uh, the pit lane is a tricky son of a bitch. You can go in at 37 miles an hour, and that's still too quick. So you have to be really careful. Mm -hmm. What is coming out of Magnus Beckett? It's going to have ERS. DRS, shall I say. Tough D, go on, son. They're all going for this. They're all going for this, which is great to see, even those down in P outside the points. <laughs> It's because you just never know what's going Someone could DN uh, DNF in front mm. of you and then you're suddenly in the points and... Yeah, exactly, yeah. What is this right on the back here of Huggy? Looks like he's going to get the move done into turn two. Oh no, he not, thought not about quite. it and then backed out a bit. There was an opportunity, but I think he just... As Waters gets a penalty. There he goes. Gonna get him down now, down the Wellington yeah. Street. Panga Strait, that's the one I was thinking of earlier. <laughs> I still felt like that. come to me. Yeah, yours is a much better name for it, but. Messi. He's getting closer to Fudge Boy. Oh, you know what? Tufty Candy's being lapped by uh, leaders again. Oh, he's not moving out the way by the look of it. Not again. Mm. As I would say, blue flag, blue flag. Yeah, indeed. It's, um... you think he would have learned the last time when he got done for that, but apparently not. Well, if he goes on the game, we'll give him a... EQ, so. Yeah, I know. So can the shoes if he's done it again. To be honest, I don't think he's close enough to. He's not now, but. No. 
feel like I may have missed something. Thanks to the tip off in the chat. Um, what is his. Uh, not pulling away from Huggy, but he's got past him. No. At least. Yeah, he's, he's gradually pulling away from him. Not. DRS is definitely helping yeah. Huggy get stay in the one second. Obviously, the slipstream, but. At the moment, I think Waters is just trying to shave his DRS. He's you know, only down to about 35%, so. He's keeping it in low mixture. Mm. Even for the straights, which is obviously helping. Huggy Man is using. Hot mix. He's only got and he's got zero percent ERS. So, well, the McLaren seems to be past the uh, back marker there. But I feel like I focus more on the battles this week, and that's not good enough for you, Jason. What can I do to make it up to you, sir? Let's have a look at Kane, who's uh, oh, struggling today because of his setup. Yeah. He's not liking those hard tyres at the moment. He's going to come out out of the points, I believe. Well, he might come out 10th. It'll be in the points, but not a lot of them to have. But we still probably one more than he's going to get next week. And I think that's the last awesome. time I bring that up today. Ah, I got the cam. Hello. <laughs> These guys, it's only been twenty one laps. On softs, they're not catching Spyro on those hard tires. They're not. No, they're not really, are they? But they're catching each other. Yeah, they're keeping each other busy. This, this rider is in the second of Tanky. Four lap old Sauce versus 19 lap old Mithards. Should be an easy one. Here we see Kane now, he's really on the charge. B7. Only a matter of moments before he takes P6, I would think. He was looking for very cap. patient because I think I think he's just he doesn't have his setup underneath him, so he's not fully confident in what where to put the car. Which I get it, it's fine. But just ahead of Tanky, there is the Ferrari of Wee Firmage. I think yeah. is it. Yeah, we first. Yes, it is. It's about two seconds up the road. So, uh. This is just getting busy now. I think he's gone wide through there. That's got to compromise him down into the Wellington. Kane gets Kane's a got a hell of a drive exit. out of there. What's DRS. the exit that is? I'll have to go to the other side. It's not preferred, but he should get the move done. Ooh, and yeah. I thought Tanky was going off then, but it's not actually a bit of lag. Yeah, it's a bit of desync. Don't worry about it. Ha! Ah. Now we can go and chase after we firmage. Look at that! Is the Look at that drive on the, the the fresh soft far outperform the used hard tyres. He's just going to be comfortable now into pull into the back of firmage, who is also on older soft tyres. So Kane has oh, at least. Is gained Point half a second in, today, that, but in that we'll see. sequence yeah. of orders already, so. Yeah. And the has, is just uh, cruising. Duffy in the pits again. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's already pulled a two sec two, nearly two and a half second gap to Tanky. In one sector. Mm. Come on, Kane. We're rooting for you, buddy. Let's go. No, one and a half seconds. So the next time round, he'll be in the RS zone. Yeah, it seems to be the way. 
yellow flag somewhere, don't know where. To be honest, I don't care anymore. Every time I go look for it, I don't find one, so... What's the point? I feel like this game is fucking with me tonight. <laughs> I reckon... It's better to do it tonight than tomorrow, I guess. But I have to race the friggin' thing. That is true. I'll be looking to bounce back for some points. I think I've sorted out my quality now, so we should be comfortable into Q2 and possibly Q3 if I don't mess up. Or, you know, let's hope I can have. Let's, let's hope I can make it past turn one. That would be uh, my goal tomorrow. I think Messi's getting on Fudge Boy as well, uh, for second place. Uh, we'll have a little, a little look a at that battle now. Bit of like, it's like a tenth a lap. He'll gain a couple oh, of tenths and lose uh, a couple of tenths. It's always worth checking out the opposition. But as this is another Kane battle on track, but is gonna be Kane is DRSA. still flying. He's definitely mm. having to lift a lot more than he would like to in high uh, throttle areas. That's not going to help. Nope. You probably lost get away with that with your own setup on, but lost not three so tenths much. There. Yeah. He wants this, and I don't blame him. But if he goes for it too much, he'll get none of it. As I almost found out to my cost last time I raced around here, I went for too much one lap and almost put it in a barrier. So instead of four points, I've got one. But one's better than none. But anyway, I'm rambling about something else. What is this? It's called the last see? lap and a half of this. We Firmage is being reeled in. Maggots and Beckett's is not the place to do that. You don't want to catch anyone through there. Oh, they both got on the grass there, so that's both to compromise their I think line. It does put the Frighteners on the car in front if you can see the car behind coming at you through Maggots and Beckett's like shit. <laughs> he's not going to go for it, is he? No. No, not quite, but I think he's just lining up a move on the, on the penultimate lap. Possibly the final lap as well. He's got an opportunity there. So it's not over yet. And he's right. Messi's actually falling back off Fudge Boy now. But Messi has so no penalties and, and no warnings. There. Fudge Boy has two penalties. So How all about over the day then? Hmm. We'll, th we'll talk about that in detail when we can. And Kane's gone in a little too deep there. And uh, left. that's that's lagged out a bit. Sad. He's eighth. He's going to lose points. But the other car that looks like Dribble's car is uh, doing quite alright right now. You just don't want to say it, do you? No. <laughs> I believe in this curse, damn it. Oh, this guy's looking on the outside. This is not the place to catch someone, as I said a lap ago. It's maggots and beckets for crying out loud. It's maggots and Ooh, beckets. Oh, Kane's lost it. He pushed a bit too nah. hard, dirty air, and the wheels come off. I told He's you. Be, I've said exactly. There. He's pushed for too much and got nothing. I've said exactly that and put him in a wall. This curse is ridiculous now. I, I think I think that people are going to start banning me from comms if this carries on. I feel for you, Kane. Well, that's tough, dude, but his fastest lap is now going to get P10. Ah. <sighs> Yeah. Good job. I couldn't sound more thrilled about that, could I? If I tried. Oh, actually, Messi's got the fastest lap. Oh, okay then. Tribal's AI is pitted. That's that's tragic. No points for that, McLaren. I actually don't think you'll get a point. Jedi David. We'll go through into 8th place now. 
Tough to candy, though, but he's got a lap behind, though, isn't he? Okay, so Tribal will stay ninth, and Death Rider should be tenth then. So we will get a Kane will get a point out of this, but that's a tenth of what he wanted, and tenth of less than what he deserved. You know what? Spiral's no, won the Tufty race. No, gets because Tufty overtook him. Ah, uh -huh. well, again, like I said, which boy second will probably drop to third on penalties. Yes, he will. Wadders. He's got a puncture. Waters has a puncture. Point left puncture. Last lap. Shit, last few corners. He's not going to mind. No, don't. Be it before you cross the line. Well, so how, sir? 25 laps. You can do 24 laps on hard, you just can't do 25. Apparently, that's the case, yeah. So, tank is fine. Connection might not be, and we'll get that tested. But, uh. The tyre is about to let go as well, to be fair. It, it looks horrendous. <laughs> Boogie Bear. Ironically, the cause of all the problems today. By not being patient on the fucking grid. Sorry, I said I wouldn't mention it again. One, three for seven. Jedi will be eighth. There we have it. Oh, drive of the day. Would, about a minute and a half ago, I would have been uh, Kane, to be fair. Well, I've got. I, just... My mind split between uh, Spyro, but uh, he's just pure speed and dominance. That, you know, he's in qualifying and the race, but then there's also Bodders who went from the back of the grid. Up to was it fourth? Yeah. You know, if he'd been actually able to qualify, would he have been up with the poles and up like that as well? So, I think undoubtedly, yeah. My drive day would have to go to Waters for his going from last of the grid up to fourth. Yeah. See, um, quite a few. I mean. Sparrow's done nothing wrong and gets no recognition at all today. That's a bit unfair of us to even not acknowledge that, but... Yeah, I know. He's had a solid race, good, controlled the a, race from the front, but... Obviously, it's a boring drive for him. I see. Fifth to, from the front. fifth to second, fastest lap of the race. Just by tenth. Uh, but I think I mean, Waters has two penalties, though. I don't like to reward people with more than one, so... Make a decision. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'm gonna split it between first, second, and fifth. It's a three-way tie, I guess. So it would have been. Let's get these people in. What we're we talking about? That I was gonna say. Who we got coming in the podium interview tonight? You got. Push boy, Spyro. Excellent. Um, messy if his mic is working. Wait for Messi. There he is. Just wait for Messi to connect. While he's connecting, we'll start with you, Fresh Boy. Obviously, P2 on track. Obviously, P3 after penalties. Do you want to sum up that race from your point of view? Hmm. Fresh Boy. 
guess he doesn't want to talk. Former teammate, damn it. <laughs> you will unmute your headset and you will talk to the media, sir. I mean, if you want. Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you now, sir. It's just Sorry, about there, batteries yeah. quickly. <laughs> That's all right. There we go. <laughs> Did you hear the question or do you want me to repeat it? Uh, repeat it for me, please, mate. Okay, obviously being P2 on track, but obviously after penalties, you drop down to P3. Uh, just sum up that race for us, please. Um, qualifying was good. I was quite happy with that. I couldn't get anywhere near Spyro to start with. It was just trading attempt for attempt there. And then I dropped it. And I ended up behind Messi. And that gave me a three second penalty. So I thought, well, I'll try the undercut. Got that done. And then I gave myself another penalty. So then I was just hoping I can get far enough in front. And hope that he had three second penalties. But no, he looked like he had a clean race. Yes, it was obviously you two were battling the last stage. Obviously, being yeah. in P2, did you was you more concentrating on making sure Messi was staying behind you, or was you actually going to you trying to push? The, no, to no. To I, once I realised, once I realised, I was never going to get anywhere near him. It was a case of keep Messi behind because he's top of the championship. So, what's the next race? Oh, I can't even remember what the next race is. In Germany? It is Germany. So, obviously, Germany's the next race. Uh, are you confident in that one? Do you think you go for the um, win? I don't think I'll go for the win. But I think wins out the question for them. Anything can happen. Stop getting penalised. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> but well done on your drive. Cheers, buddy. Very solid. Um, yeah. Messi looks like he's having problems connecting. So, if you want to, Mackie, can you remove him and try to invite him back? Yep. Um, seems while to that's be doing, we'll like go to connect my privates. Our race winner, Spyro. Oh, yeah. Hello. Um, obviously, you. Quickest in quali, quickest in the race. Obviously, you pulled a gap. You just dominated. Obviously, I bet you're thrilled with that race. A bit boring, but thrilled. Yeah, I mean, qualifying was tense. There was only, a, I think, a couple of hundredths in it in the end. Mm -hmm. I mean, I could have gone quicker, but as soon as I saw, I did my first lap, and then as soon as I saw Jedi beat me, I was like, no, that's it, I'm going again. And then it just happened to be pole. Um, but yeah, got out in the race, had a good start. Fudge Boy was keeping up with me, keeping the pressure on, and I was thinking, okay, here we go. But then I went in for the hards, he went in for the softs, and then I knew, that's it, I've got it. <coughs> yeah, I think everyone went in for the softs. Even me and Mac are a bit stiff, but obviously you went in for the hards, but we obviously, you were obviously weighing up tie wear at the end of the stint, rather than going for the fastest for the first five, six laps, so. Yeah, well, I did a practice the other day, and... I could only get six laps out of the soft, so I was like, well, I'm going to go mediums to hards, and then if someone can bring back down the gap in six laps, then fair play to them, they deserve the win. Obviously, Germany in the next track. Are you uh, you looking for another win out of that one? Uh, depends whether Wadders turns up for qualifying or not, I think. Yes, Wadders went from uh, back of the grid to fourth, so it's a very good Yeah, I had... Wadders. My engineer interested, shout out to him, giving me updates on Wadders, and I was thinking, no, no, he's getting a bit closer. <laughs> <laughs> well, he had, he had a puncture on the last two corners, so he was lucky. Yeah. But, uh, yes, very well done. And I'll Thank you. We'll be delighted to see you next week. Yeah. We'll go to now our P2 man, Mr. If Messi. Obviously, P3 on track, but obviously with the penalties, P2. Um, just sum up that race for us, if you can. Um, yeah, I got in some trouble with the... Uh... Oh, first of all, I want to thank the fans, of course. They with me again. <laughs> no, uh, I got in some trouble uh, in the first bit. I dropped a few places. And then, uh, I think Duffy spun in front of me. And then... 
got behind uh, Fudge Boy, and he was staying like uh, nine seconds ahead of me constantly until he popped. Uh, I think he spun off him in one turn in Megas Baggots. Yeah. Then I got closer and uh, he pitted like the undercut, and then I was just chasing times. Because I know he had a three second penalty, so I was just trying to stay behind them in that gap. Shout out to Wada, he did an awesome job coming from the back. That was crazy. Yes. But I'm happy with the points, stay, stay on lead of the championship, I hope, so hope to keep scoring the points. <coughs> yeah, obviously the people behind you obviously trying to catch up, so obviously with Brendan to Germany, is your mindset you, you need to win, or are you happy just keep getting the podiums and... Mm, as long as I keep getting podiums, uh, today were a good day because uh, a clock and what else were behind me. So good day today. Put on it. But yeah, but uh, very well done, drive. Well done to the top three. And that's it, Mikey. Okay, thanks. Uh, great job, everyone. Um, <clears throat> uh, many congratulations to the podium and all the finishes today. Uh, some drivers got unlucky today with. Um, external and we'll deal with that in our own time but next week I'm not here so someone else will be filling in this hot seat alongside AMS uh, Firebird <laughs> I forgot <laughs> Phoenix for a second uh, so it'll be not me next week around Germany and we'll be back uh, same time tomorrow good night see you later